Hello and welcome back to my channel Crypto Cat Guru. If you clicked on this video, I'm sure you're also not satisfied with the development speed of VV at the moment. In this video, I will tell you why VV and the Vverse could fail in the upcoming years if they don't keep up with the development speed of their competitors. No, God, please, no, 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 no! Competitors, you ask, which competitors? I will explain it to you in this video. I will also show you what one of the biggest ETH whales at the moment in the space thinks about the IP collectibles at the moment. So stick with me until the end of the video. With that out of the way, let's dive right in guys. Vivi has promised a Ready Player One experience in 2020, which means that you will be able to use your collectibles in different experiences, games and metaverses. Until now, we have not yet seen anything of these promises come to life. And also the viewers will most likely be nothing else than a glorified showroom at this point in time. What if I tell you that there is already a company out there that has been building a technology platform with interoperability and AI features in the Web3 space? That could make the Ready Player One experience come to life in the upcoming year. This is the trailer for Open, our AAA metaverse gaming experience. What if I tell you that this metaverse will soon have also other branded IP collectibles in the metaverse, like Lamborghinis for example, with which you can build your own collection in your showroom, but also be able to race in different digital experiences. What if I tell you that these Lamborghinis will be interoperable with other metaverse experiences on their platform? Our goal is to create vehicles that you want to collect, but that are not disposable. So that are compatible with game after game after game, and you can bring them and you can improve them. And there's, you know, rather than just playing a game, collecting all the cars and then waiting for the next release and having to go through from zero again. So you will, you could be known for the car you're driving in the metaverse or the vehicle. Do you really think your digital collectibles on VV will hold any value? Will your collectibles on VV be still recognized in the Web3 space if the Vverse is just boring and does not offer any utility to your collectibles? Readyverse is an ambitious project created by Readyverse Studios aimed at developing a dynamic metaverse and AI platform, starting with bringing the Ready Player One franchise into the Web3 space. They have an exclusive partnership with Warner Brothers Discovery to bring the Ready Player One experience onto the Readyverse platform. Readyverse mission is to provide creators and also entrepreneurs with the tools and AI features needed to build and enhance digital collectibles projects efficiently and affordably. Utility and interoperability is king in the space and those companies that will offer the most immersive and open experience for the consumer will win in the end the race in the Web3 space. Readyverse has already worked over six years on their metaverse and AI features and therefore has definitely an advantage over Vivi and the Viviverse experience. I'm also following one of the biggest ethers in the Web3 space. Let's listen in to what he thinks about IP branded collectibles like the one from VV or HRO with no utility. Uh, I mean, they look really cool, but what do they do, right? I mean, it's okay if they are digital collectibles for the sake of being digital collectibles, but what do they do? So, you know, again, and the other th reason why I'm probably not going to buy any of these is because it started like a while ago, right? It started like a while ago. As you can see, even people in the Web3 space don't understand the collector's mindset as long as they cannot do anything with it. 
So what I really want to see for Vivi to succeed in the upcoming years, interoperability of collectibles with other experiences or metaverses. It can be clunky, it can be buggy, I don't care. But this would prove that Vivi is able to do interoperability and gamification. This could be as simple as a portal which is placed in your Viviverse showroom that leads you to an experience in Wilder World, Readyverse or any other leading metaverse experience where you will be able to use your collectibles. We don't need full interoperability on the blockchain at this stage, but we should be at least able to portal our 3D collectibles into other metaverse experiences where we can get more utility and gamified experiences. The easiest use case I could think of would be a racetrack in Wilder World or Readyverse where we can race our VV Lamborghinis on an existing racetrack. An MVP like this should definitely be realizable in a one year period. Remember, the experience does not need to be perfect. It just needs to show the willingness for gamified and open experiences with other metaverses. This means actually Vivi does not have to build everything themselves in the Viviverse from scratch as other metaverses will be able to bring more utility to the Vivi collectibles. This would prove that Vivi is able to bring an early stage of Ready Player One experience to life. I have also already seen another Web2 game with a Ready Player One theme that will come out in the upcoming year, which is called Everywhere. In this metaverse, you will be able to earn points by creating gamified shooter and racing experiences yourself. And here's a short glimpse into the trailer. What if we could build a world? What would we do if we could start again? What would we create? This is everywhere. A world where we can transform it, improve it, make it our own. We are all architects of this new world where our imagination is our only limit and where our creations can come to life. Come with me and build what's never been built. Our reality. Our friends. Your imagination. build it together so as you can see the ready player one theme will hit hard in the upcoming years and if you want vivi to be part of it then make sure to hit that like button down below and also share the video on your socials also guys if you're interested in more information about the readyverse i have posted a video about the readyverse project and the root network token on my channel don't forget to comment down below see you until next time your crypto cat guru